this kind of looks nice. So I was thinking, I haven't used this in a long time. This is the Ambient Soft Glow Foundation. And the reason I haven't used it in a while is because it's been the wrong color for me. Usually I have a self tan and I am completely my fair self. I've already primed my skin with Tarte Timeless Smoothing Primer um, because I do find that when I go with a lighter skin tone, even though that is my natural skin tone, my pores show up more and all the texture shows up more. So we'll see how this goes. I'm just gonna pat it on. A little bit goes a long way with this foundation. It has a little bit of a fuller coverage and it says soft glow, but I would say it is more of a skin finish. I don't really feel like it gives much of a glow compared to some of the other foundations that I use. Yeah, that matches. So if you're my skin tone, I know it's hard to tell on camera, you would be a number five. Around my pores, I'm just dippling, okay? So if I swipe and wipe, it can tend to kind of just glide over it and leave little holes. But if I push it in like this, where my pores are more visible, it will help hide them. I'm gonna use Lancome's Tanti Doll Ultra Wear Concealer. I don't normally let myself get this light. There, that looks better. When I'm this light, usually I will use the Hoola Bronze in light. It's a perfect tone for fair skin, I find. A lot of people don't know that it comes in light, but it does. Okay, some dimension is back, thank goodness. And I think I will put a little bit on my nose. It's like when it's this light, it glows. <laughs> and it makes it look bigger i find instead of soft ochre paint pop by mac i will always use painterly and it just seems to go with my light skin tone now i can add whatever color i want i'm gonna go ahead and put some more color in my face so that i can stand how i look and i'm using the dior backstage blush in pink i'm gonna use buxom powerline lip liner in dangerous dolly i'm gonna put buxom lip gloss on this was not planned and then white sangria over top I'm just gonna use a couple out of the Natasha Denona for my dream palette. This color is called Spontaneous. Sparkle is my favorite color. I think I'm gonna use a little bit of this one. And that's it. This one is called Nurture. Yeah, this looks good. Putting it in the outer corner first. Drag over top of the shimmer and whatever's left on my brush into the crease. I'm gonna use the same color I used in my crease underneath my lash line. I'm gonna take a little bit of Unity and pull it up a little bit onto my brow bone. And that's because when I opened my eyes, I couldn't see the color. So I'm going over top of my crease so that you can see it. All right, all done. I have a feeling that this makeup is going to stay a very long time. I will put a comment in the comment section below when I come home tonight and tell you how it lasted. I hope this helps and I will see you later. Bye.